Hey, what's up guys? This is Mad Bagger Michael coming back at you live with another inside look at some amazing new Loungefly products. Okay guys, for today, we're gonna be diving deep, looking at one of my favorite series of bags that started last year. It is for the Villain Scene series. Okay, the bag I'm gonna show you today is the newest addition to that series. This will put us at number seven or number eight so far in this collection. So if you are super into the villains like I am, you are absolutely gonna love collecting the Villain Scene series. So let's go ahead and let's show you the newest addition to this collection. Okay, the newest addition to the Villain Scene series is gonna be the Gaston Lenticular Mirror Mini Backpack. Now this one is super, super cool. Again, this series just started in June of 2021. The very first bags they gave us were Maleficent and Ursula, and they've been slowly working their way through all the villains from the classic Disney cartoon movies. Okay, now this one, of course, no exception to iconicness. This is gonna be Gaston from Beauty and the Beast. And a really cool feature that they did on this bag was the lenticular display on the front pocket, which is absolutely amazing. Now, this is not the only lenticular bag that Loungefly has ever done. They have also done a Bill and Scene's Evil Queen mini backpack. Now, that backpack was not in the core catalog. That was an exclusive, I believe, to Loungefly.com, but it is considered to be part of the series. So if you add that one into the series, it puts the bag somewhere total around eight or nine bags so far in this collection. And they still have more villains to give us. So I would imagine we're going to see more this year. Okay, so this bag is made of vegan leather. It does have that classic silhouette style from uh, Loungefly, which would mean it has that nice front pocket. It's going to be more of a round pocket. Sometimes they give a square, sometimes they give us rectangle. But as you can see, the really, really uh, kind of star on this bag is going to be that lenticular mirror where you're going to get the beast. And then as you turn it, you're going to get Belle in her town out attire. And they did a really good job with this applique of the mirror. You got like the lighting bolts and the really cool, um, the really cool roses and details that give it that kind of mirror frame shape. Absolutely cool. Up top here, there he is, Mr. Gaston himself. <laughs> Okay, he's gonna be done as a, an applique on the top of the bag. Now, the vegan leather on this bag is mostly gonna be the smooth style. I don't think there are any textured vegan leathers on this. It's pretty much gonna be all the nice smooth finish. You're gonna have the enamel badge, which will be on the side. This one will have side pockets on both sides. Okay, the nice mirror does hide a nice sized round pocket on the front. Now, really cool about this bag, they did a really cool like orange uh, color zipper pulls, which I've never seen them use this color before, so it's really neat. Now those are the heavy duty uh, lounge fly zipper pulls from the core catalog. Uh, they did the contrasting straps on the back, which is gonna be kind of like a brown, kind of that leather look. Biceps to spare. Of course, that's <laughs> perfect for Mr. Gaston. Absolutely awesome. That is gonna be, um, it looks like it's printed on there. It's not debossed or anything. It's gonna be printed. Okay, let's go ahead and take a look on the inside. Again, I love the color that they did on these zipper poles. And we've been seeing them do some more fun colors, like neon pinks. And uh, this is like a really neon kind of, or a really bright metallic orange color. Okay, here's the interior of the Gaston Villain Scenes bag. You're gonna have Le Fleur along with Gaston in there. Okay, again, this year they're giving us uh, pockets pretty much on the entire, uh, in, on the inside of every single mini backpack. Most of the times it's an open pocket. Sometimes they do a zipper pocket. Okay, nice deep storage space there. Lots of space to store all your favorite things. Again, look at that really cool scene there. Okay, now they did do, this is part of a collection. Pretty much the whole villain scene series has been a backpack and a wallet. They haven't been doing any crossbodies. I think it would've been a nice addition to do a crossbody in some of the villains, because I know not all of us want to have the mini backpack. Some of us want to have the purses, but but I can't complain because they've been doing such a good job with style, stylizing all these and making sure every uh, little detail is covered. Okay, here is going to be the matching wallet for the Gaston Villain Scene series. You're going to have Gaston and Belle 
Now, this is a full-size zip-around wallet. Bell and Gaston are all done in vegan leather appliques. You do have a little bit of the scene from the tavern in the background there. You kind of see the chandelier going on. Bell looking not so impressed. <laughs> Man, I wish I had biceps like Gaston. He's ripped, right? <laughs> but that just shows you that sometimes you got you got to have a personality too, right? And he's a little bit too narcissistic for a lot of people. Okay, this right here is going to be La Fleur and some of the tavern girls who are just absolutely enamored with Gaston. And you have the Disney lounge fly enamel badge. You got, again, you got some of the scene there from the tavern. Now the enamel badge on this, they did a brown, which is, I, I don't see that too terribly often. They do a really good job with getting that color set in there on that metal. Really cool. Okay, I love the details when they do this. To me, this is like a, a whole extra level of detail that they're doing. Um, and they don't do this on every single wall, but they've been doing it. Especially in the Villain Scene series, they've been, they've been touching almost every surface on these bags. So this one here has biceps to spare. That is laser engraved or embossed into the vegan leather. I love the color brown that they chose for this. It looks like, a, like the color that you would have if you actually had real leather, right? Has the same lining as the um, mini backpack. Okay, it's going to have the same type of really nice bright orange. Okay, you're going to have the nice deep money pocket and change. Now, the Villain Scene series, again, this has been starting. It started in July, June of 2021. I think it was June. June was, I think, was the original, original release. The stuff might not have showed up until July, but I think the very first bags were in June. And it's continued, and it looks like it's going to continue pretty much uh, for the rest of this year as we get more villains into this collection. Okay, this is what the collection looks like. Now, both of these are available right now on maddagger.com. They are also available in our mobile app. If you want to see a little more details on them, we have all the nice close-up photos. Or you can always jump on the live show with me and ask to see specific details on each item. Okay, guys. Thanks for hanging out. We'll see you again soon. Later.